Oh, well, hey, it's Dave, and I am standing in the, uh, what we call the piano room, and um, uh, Carson's also got a freaking giant marimba over here. Uh, and it's Saturday morning, and uh, my big event yesterday was something I'm gonna talk about really quick here on this video blog, which is kind of an unusual thing for me because normally I don't do video blogs, but um, I got a tattoo yesterday, and I'm gonna show it to you because I'm showing this off, and thanks to Hired Guns Tattoo um, uh, Studio, that's what they call it, Studio, up in Crystal, and um, Daniel and Jay and Marie are three of the nicest people I've met in a long time, and we had a great time, and it took about uh, about two hours to do, now here comes the, the hard part, and that's showing the back of my leg here, to do that, and I'm really happy with it. That is kind of a coincidence because that's the exact boom box that I had when I was in high school because I looked up boom boxes on Google image search and that's the first one that, that came up. And then so when Jay drew it, um, uh, I think Jay's the one who drew it, yeah, I believe he is. Um, I looked at it and I said, holy crap, that's the same one that I had when I was in high school. And I had it for years and then I left it in rewind mode one day and the motor burned out and I didn't realize that I had left it in remind mode for like a week or something like that. And then here is my other uh, tattoo that I got uh, in, I don't know, about 2006, 2007, 2008, something like that. So I'm pretty happy with them. I like them and uh, just wanted to show those to you in a video blog form. So yeah, Carson plays piano, drums, and marimba, and he's also got, my God, I didn't even notice this over here, he's also got like a xylophone over here. So um, he's supposed to be practicing the marimba this, uh, this summer, and he kind of moderately has a little bit here and there. Uh, so anyway, I don't know anything about tattoos, but I was talking to Daniel, and he said, uh, I said, Daniel, what have you talked people out of getting? And he said, I've talked people out of getting a lot of stuff. He said, usually it's something stupid like a Hello Kitty smoking a bong, or a Smurf smoking a joint, or something like that. I was originally gonna do the uh, tombstone that says, well, fuck, on the tombstone, but then I thought, mm, I don't really want the F word on my body for the rest of my life, so I went with the um, boom box instead. I'm pretty happy about that. But Daniel and I agreed, I was talking to some other people, uh, that's a clock, that's, uh, that's a clock that I got from my mom and dad, Back when I was probably 18, I got it for him for Christmas, and uh, we still have it. So um, that's what that was. But I talked to Daniel, and he said that he agreed that you should never go into a tattoo store and look at what they call flash. Is that what they call it? It's basically walls and walls of pictures and designs that you can choose from. Never go through a notebook and say, oh, look at this. There's a heart with a dolphin on it. You should always have a tattoo in mind that means something to you. And obviously the microphone and the radio mean a lot to me. Um, but I think that's good advice. Don't you think that you should always have something that means a lot to you? But then again, you know, it's your choice. You do whatever the hell you want to. And I'll tell you one more thing about my philosophy on tattoos. People always say, well, that's going to look like crap when you're 48, or that's going to look like crap when you're 70. Let me tell you something. Tattoos on young people, they look amazing. They look great. So do it. Here's why. When you get to be 52, your body's going to look like shit anyway, probably. So don't worry. It's not going to look so much, oh my God, look how good he looks because he never got a tattoo. Your body's not going to look good when you're 52 or 68 anyway. So, and if you're 52 years old going, my body looks okay, I think you still know what I mean. Your body look, probably does look okay. But get a tattoo if you want to. So that is my vlog on uh, tattoos. And thanks for watching. I appreciate it.